As I travel around Alberta, I've been talking about five priorities for our province as we move forward. And of course, energy and the environment are key components of my vision. One of my priorities is the necessity of taking action to ensure that as Albertans, we maximize the value of our natural resources for this generation and the next. We need to improve our access to the world's fastest growing markets, those of the Asia Pacific Basin. And gaining access to tide water is essential. Right now we sell all of our oil and gas to the United States and we have learned the hard way that an energy producer with only one customer will repeatedly be forced to sell at a discount. And so we will work to ensure that critical infrastructure is built so that our products can access the Pacific by both rail and pipeline. And there will be no access to the Asia Pacific Basin for our energy unless we strike a partnership with the government of British Columbia and a partnership with First Nations in BC, in particular, the coastal First Nations. And to be frank, none of this will happen without the right individual serving as our Premier. Our economic future depends on access to global markets and achieving global prices. It also depends on maximizing our potential in the petrochemical industry. Alberta is already a significant global player in the ethane value chain. Under my leadership, we will ensure that the investment conditions are right for businesses looking to develop a similar petrochemical chain using propane, where we turn natural gas liquids into materials like plastics. This represents a whole new line of business to add to Alberta's portfolio of commodities. We must always keep our eye on the big picture. Alberta can only realize its full potential by attracting global capital and skilled workers. And to attract foreign direct investment, we need smart fiscal policies that make us competitive globally and a foreign investment climate that welcomes overseas investors. We can't be naive about this. We will need to compete for global capital, technology and skilled labor. And I stand firm in my belief that we must establish our province as an environmental leader. We are in the energy business, so we must also be in the environment business. I support rigorous environmental standards while ensuring the continued responsible development of our oil and gas industry. We will not damage the competitiveness of our oil and gas industry by unilaterally imposing costs, carbon charges and regulations. I believe in a government of creativity and innovation, one that is prudent but that moves forward with confidence. Please join me and take action today by visiting www.jimprentice.ca.